in these areas where there's no natural rock, putting a big pile of rocks has some consequences a lot of times. So this isn't that bad because it's not very deep, but normally this will have a ton of rock on there and then this is this becomes a rattlesnake den and it's right next to a um, bunch of homes. So the challenge is for late October, uh, we need to find a place that is not only suitable for a snake normally, but suitable for a, an adult western diamondback that is looking to den, that's looking to get out of the elements for the year. It is nearly the end of October and whenever there is a rattlesnake at a house, it's not much of a random event. Uh, the snakes are there for a reason at this point, and that is they're looking to hibernate. And that means that every snake hall that we go to, um, there's an additional task of trying to find more and also see if we can just give the homeowner any information that we can about how to prevent future rattlesnakes from showing up.